This one's a bit dark. Wow. Better get a workout done. Alright, what's up? My hair is getting huge. Ridiculous. Um, so it is Wednesday and I'm doing my shoulders and delts workout, or my shoulders and arms workout because I work on Thursday. I've been working on Thursdays the last while. So the easiest thing to do is to just do the workout on a Wednesday and then I don't need to get it done tomorrow, you know. Um, so I'm just going to bring you through it now. Hoping that I'm actually going to finish my three sets of ten on one band for uh, chin-ups this morning. And I'm not going to make this super long. I'm sure you're completely sick of me recording workouts. <sighs> but we'll get to a gym eventually. Get a barbell eventually. Get more weight eventually. We'll get there. Alright, so I got my three sets of ten with one band, so next week I'm going to no bands for chin-ups. That's going to really, really suck, but it, I'm really happy with that progress. Oh my god. Um, so, really happy with that progress. And now I'm on Arnold Press, and I actually found more weight, so I can actually put my dumbbell up to, from like 12 kilos up to like 14 kilos, or actually... Yeah, 14 kilos I think, I don't think I can get the ones on. So I can increase my weight for some of my exercises now. So that's exactly what I'm going to do for the iron press. So I'm going to build up the dumbbell and I'll record it. Right, so two bands, and I'm just doing like slow uh, front raises. Don't know how many reps I'm gonna get because I don't think I've done two bands before. They are super hard. If I can do two more sets of ten. Trying to build up the strength in my shoulders as well. When I eventually get back to a gym, I don't have weak shoulders, so we have to keep going. Progress, probably the most said word in all of these videos. You get me. Right, so doing like banded lateral raises, I just do like I have been doing just like arm wrap sets, just like trying to get as many as I can. I'm gonna try and do four sets of twenty today because I generally try, or I generally try to, or yeah, I generally start failing around twenty. So. Right. So just gonna do tricep dips now. So four sets of twenty-five, so hundred reps on. So I still have the 14 kilo dumbbell and I'm just doing decent concentration curls. So I think I'm going to do like 3 sets of 12, which is heavy and we can progress from 3 sets of 12 onwards. Right, so um, just to finish off the workout, I'm going to do uh, there's like a Joe Wicks 5 minute abs thing. So I don't want to lose a lot of weight and then not have any abs because I don't because I haven't bothered to train them when I work so hard to build muscle in all the other parts of my body that it would be 
pointless that I wouldn't train abs. So I'm gonna do that now. But I can't I don't really have anywhere that I can record myself on the ground from any sort of respectable angle. So what I'm going to do is not record it and I'll just talk to you afterwards. <sighs> I hate doing abs. <sighs> Stomachs and bits. Have to play golf later. Generally like there's a lot of times I will get like sore abs from playing golf mainly just because I'm bad at golf but like whew, that's tough but yeah really good workout took me ages because I was messing on my phone and doing other stuff I really need to like stop doing that but I'm happy Um it was a good workout hopefully I'm gonna get you some sort of other content for this week's video I am playing golf today but the weather's not great, so I'll see what I can do. Um, I'm playing golf on Friday, so I have two more chances of getting some sort of half-decent content. And, yeah, I hope that you guys are having a good week so far. Yeah. Alright, so it is Friday, and we are back on that Olympic lifting attempts. So still trying to get into get the snatch going so I think if I can get myself because I know I want right look we're just gonna give it a go I have the dumbbell set up to be 7 kg today and I'm just gonna go with it try and just get up into some sort of a decent spot I figured from last week that I want to be pulling pulling it the whole way up and trying to keep my arms straight and flicking it out and then just getting under it so let's see if we can make any progress hopefully you can see from there Oh, these are hard. I really fell that time. Alright, one more. They're so tough. I actually don't know if, like, I don't understand how people can do them heavy. Like, there's so much movement in it. Oh, wow. Right, last exercise. I am just doing cleans again. I think I'm getting there. I'm trying to get my elbows, or, like, my wrists into the right position, to, like, a proper rock position. But, um, yeah, so I've upped the weight from seven to nine kilos I think so let's see how we go
We're getting there. We're getting there. Hold for a barbell resumes. Let me do my check in next. Alright, what's up? So it's actually Sunday because I completely forgot to record my check in on Friday. So I'm just gonna get all of this done in one clip because I'm an idiot and I completely forgot to do it. Um I've been really lax at recording this week. So um I'm gonna try and be better next week. Work is getting quite quite busy, but uh gonna try and do a better job next week. Um so Overall this week actually kind of decent enough. So I was down 0.2 of a pound, like it's tiny, like 0.2 of a pound is like 90 grams, like it's nothing. But it's progress and progress is progress. So hopefully next week, like I, I tend to weigh myself sometimes during the week a bit and I did weigh in at like 210-ish during the week. So I'm hoping that this week I'll just drop down to like 209, who knows, but we'll see. Um, other than that, I had chest 40.5, waist 38.5, legs 25.5, and arms 15.75. Like, arms are a little bit smaller, maybe less palm, maybe they're losing a bit of fat, I don't know. Um, but yeah, I'm still happy with the progress. I am, however, getting really sick of the workout. I, I'm just bored of it been in it for 12 weeks now uh, with the announcement on Friday that gyms are going, should be opening in like mid-July means that as soon as this ends I should be able to go back to the gym or as, like as soon as this challenge ends the week after I'll be going back to the gym fingers crossed but until then I want something to do I think it's another six weeks six weeks so I'm going to try and do a different workout for the six weeks if I can. So obviously it gives me more stuff to film, show you what I'm doing. Um, so I'm going to look into doing that. And other than that, um, didn't get a golf video done. The day I wanted to do it this week turned out it was raining and yeah, I wasn't going to be recording in the rain again. Didn't want to. It's just awkward. So yeah. Very unexciting week, probably not a great video, but, oh yeah, I had my first cheat meal last night, um, got to see my girlfriend properly for the first time in three months, and we decided we were going to get ourselves a nice dinner, um, got a takeaway from a restaurant, and really nice, so it was very nice to get to see her again. Um, obviously it's been very tough to be apart and not get to see each other properly for three months and it was nice to celebrate it so cheap meal I know McDonald's is also open mmm gonna have to stay away from there but we'll see um, yeah quite happy overall progress still coming I'm feeling a lot lighter I'm feel like I'm noticing my clothes are baggy on me I'm not like even like pulling up my underwear that I've had for a while that I'm noticing that that is just coming up very loose now rather than like being tight on my legs and stuff so I'm, I'm really happy um, yeah nine pounds to go let's see how much we can lose this week and hopefully we can make it really easy on ourselves for the last few weeks thanks guys